Deep in the Bekaa Valley Lebanon, an ancient site whispers tales of architectural prowess. This valley, rich in history and culture, has been a cradle of civilizations for millennia. From the Phoenicians to the Romans, each era has left its indelible mark on this land. But among all these historical imprints, one site stands out, shrouded in mystery and awe. Baalbek. Once a grand Roman temple complex, now a treasure trove of mysteries. The grandeur of its architecture is a testament to the ingenuity and ambition of its builders. The Temple of Bacchus with its towering columns still stands as a symbol of ancient engineering marvels. But beyond its visible splendor, Baalbek holds secrets that continue to baffle historians and archaeologists alike. Amongst those crumbling columns and weathered statues, something extraordinary lies in wait. These remnants of a bygone era are not just relics, they are clues to a past that defies our understanding. The precision with which these structures were built raises questions about the techniques and tools used by ancient builders. Were they privy to knowledge that has since been lost, something that makes modern engineering look like child's play? In an age where we pride ourselves on technological advancements, the feats achieved at Baalbek seem almost supernatural. Modern cranes and machinery despite their sophistication, would struggle to replicate the precision and scale of these ancient constructions. It's a humbling reminder of the ingenuity of our ancestors. Imagine stones so massive cranes would quiver at their feet. These megalithic blocks, some weighing over a thousand tons, were transported and placed with such accuracy that even a hairline gap is hard to find. The logistics of moving such colossal stones without modern machinery is a puzzle that continues to intrigue researchers. Blocks weighing more than a jumbo jet, placed with laser-like precision. The alignment and positioning of these stones suggest a level of expertise that seems almost otherworldly. How did they achieve such precision? What tools did they use? These questions remain unanswered, adding to the enigma of Baalbek. How? Why? The very stones seem to mock our modern arrogance. They stand as silent sentinels challenging our understanding of history and technology. Each stone is a testament to a forgotten era, a time when human ingenuity knew no bounds. The more we learn about Baalbek the more we realize how much we have yet to discover. Did our ancestors possess knowledge lost to the sands of time? As the sun sets over the ancient ruins casting long shadows and a golden hue, one can't help but wonder about the secrets buried beneath the stones. Baalbek is not just a site of historical significance. It is a gateway to understanding the incredible capabilities of ancient civilizations. The mysteries of Baalbek continue to inspire awe and curiosity, urging us to delve deeper into the annals of history. Let's talk Titans, the stone of the pregnant woman, a behemoth abandoned in the quarry. A colossal 1,000 tons it sits, a testament to ambition and a slap in the face to our understanding of the past. Imagine the audacity, even the Romans, renowned builders marveled at these megaliths. They incorporated them into their temples, seemingly clueless about their true origins. Talk about inheriting a mystery, it's like finding a spaceship in your garage and using it as a shed. These weren't just any stones, they were meticulously shaped, some over 60 feet long. Their surfaces, smooth and straight, speak of advanced techniques. Were these primitive chisels and hammers or something more? Laser-guided rock cutters, perhaps? Okay, maybe not lasers. Or maybe. The Romans, for all their aqueducts and roads, left no blueprints for this. No bragging rights in their chronicles. Just awe. Almost as if they knew they were dealing with forces beyond their comprehension. Makes you think, doesn't it? Picture this. Dragging a thousand-ton stone across miles of rugged terrain. No asphalt, no bulldozers, no Starbucks for the weary workers. How? The mind boggles. Did they use legions of slaves, magical spells, or maybe aliens? All right, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Modern engineers scratch their heads, even with our cranes and hydraulics. Moving such weights is a Herculean task. It seems the ancients were playing a whole different game, one we haven't quite figured out the rules to yet. We can barely build a skyscraper that doesn't sway in the wind. Despite all our technological advancements, the marvels of modern engineering still face challenges. Our skyscrapers, though towering and impressive, are designed to flex and bend to withstand the forces of nature. This is a testament to our understanding of materials and physics, yet it also highlights our limitations. 
we rely on complex calculations, advanced materials, and cutting-edge technology to achieve what ancient civilizations seem to accomplish with far simpler means. And these guys were slinging around thousand-ton blocks like it was nothing. The ancient builders with their rudimentary tools and techniques managed feats that boggle the mind. They moved massive stones, some weighing as much as a modern locomotive, with a precision that rivals today's best efforts. How did they do it? Was it sheer manpower, ingenious engineering, or perhaps a combination of both? The methods they used remain a topic of debate and fascination among historians and engineers alike. Makes you wonder if our priorities are a bit skewed. In our quest for progress, have we overlooked the wisdom of the past? We spend billions on skyscrapers, yet we still can't fully explain how the pyramids were built. Our ancestors left behind clues, but deciphering them requires a shift in perspective. Perhaps we need to value ancient knowledge as much as we do modern innovation. More Instagram followers or unlocking the secrets of the past? Tough choice. In today's digital age our attention is often divided. Social media and instant gratification dominate our lives, while the mysteries of ancient civilizations remain unsolved. Imagine if we invested as much time and resources into understanding our history as we do into our online presence. The insights we could gain might not only answer age-old questions but also inspire new ways of thinking and problem-solving. Some say it was ramps and rollers, others, sheer manpower. Theories abound about how ancient builders achieved their monumental tasks. Ramps, levers, and rollers are often cited, but none of these explanations fully account for the precision and scale of their work. Could there be other yet undiscovered methods? Or perhaps a lost technology that we have yet to rediscover? The ingenuity of our ancestors continues to challenge our understanding and push the boundaries of what we believe is possible, but the sheer scale of Baalbek makes these explanations feel inadequate. The ruins of Baalbek, with their colossal stone blocks, stand as a testament to the incredible capabilities of ancient builders. These stones, some weighing over a thousand tons, were transported and placed with such precision that even modern machinery would struggle to replicate the feat. The mystery of Baalbek challenges us to think beyond conventional explanations and consider the possibility that ancient civilizations possessed knowledge and skills that have been lost to time, like explaining a smartphone with smoke signals. Comparing our understanding of ancient construction techniques to explaining modern technology with primitive methods highlights the gap in our knowledge. Just as smoke signals are a far cry from the capabilities of a smartphone, our current theories may be missing key elements that ancient builders took for granted. Bridging this gap requires an open mind and a willingness to explore unconventional ideas. We need to think bigger, bolder, perhaps even weirder. To truly understand and appreciate the achievements of ancient civilizations, we must be willing to challenge our assumptions and explore new possibilities. This means embracing creativity, innovation, and a willingness to look beyond the obvious. By doing so, we not only honor the ingenuity of the past, but also pave the way for future breakthroughs that could redefine our understanding of what is possible. Section 6. Theories Take Flight from the mundane to the outlandish. Oh, the theories, aliens of course. The idea that we are not alone in the universe has captivated the human imagination for centuries. From ancient texts to modern day sightings, the possibility of extraterrestrial life has been a source of endless speculation and wonder. Some believe that ancient civilizations had contact with these beings and that their advanced knowledge was passed down through the ages. Could it be that the Great Pyramids and other monumental structures were built with the help of alien technology? Or perhaps these stories are simply a reflection of our desire to find meaning in the unknown. Lost civilizations with vibranium tools. Imagine a world where ancient societies possess technology far beyond our own. The legends of Atlantis, Lemuria and other mythical lands speak of advanced cultures that vanished without a trace. These stories often include descriptions of powerful tools and materials, like the fictional vibranium, that could revolutionize our understanding of history. Were these civilizations real, or are they just the product of our collective imagination? The mystery continues to intrigue historians and archaeologists alike. Giants who played marbles with these stones. Throughout history, there have been tales of giants who once roamed the earth. These colossal beings are said to have moved massive stones with ease, creating the megalithic structures that still baffle us today. From the giant stone spheres of Costa Rica to the towering statues of Easter Island, the evidence of their existence is scattered across the globe. 
But are these stories based on fact, or are they simply myths that have been passed down through generations? It's a buffet of the bizarre, seasoned with a dash of desperation to explain the unexplainable. The human mind is naturally curious and when faced with the unknown, we often create elaborate theories to fill in the gaps. From ancient astronauts to lost continents these ideas capture our imagination and offer tantalizing glimpses into what might have been. But while some theories are grounded in evidence, others are little more than flights of fancy. The challenge lies in separating fact from fiction. The truth, as always, is probably more grounded. While it's fun to speculate about ancient aliens and lost civilizations, the reality is often much more mundane. The incredible achievements of our ancestors were likely the result of ingenuity, hard work, and a deep understanding of their environment. By studying the tools, techniques, and materials they used, we can gain a greater appreciation for their accomplishments and learn valuable lessons for our own time. But that doesn't make it any less fascinating. The true stories of our past are just as compelling as any myth or legend. The ingenuity and resourcefulness of ancient peoples continue to inspire and amaze us. Each new discovery adds another piece to the puzzle of our shared history, revealing the incredible diversity and complexity of human civilization. Whether it's a beautifully carved stone or a meticulously crafted tool, these artifacts connect us to our ancestors and remind us of our enduring quest for knowledge. What if we've been looking at this all wrong? Sometimes, our assumptions and biases can cloud our understanding of the past. By challenging conventional wisdom and exploring alternative perspectives, we can gain new insights into ancient mysteries. What if the key to unlocking these secrets lies not in the physical evidence but in the stories and traditions that have been passed down through generations? By listening to the voices of the past, we may uncover hidden truths that have been overlooked or forgotten. What if the answer lies not in brute force? but in forgotten knowledge, in a different understanding of the world, ancient peoples may have possessed knowledge and skills that have been lost to time. By re-examining their achievements through a modern lens, we can uncover new ways of thinking and problem solving. Whether it's the construction of massive stone structures or the development of advanced tools, the secrets of the past hold valuable lessons for the future. As we continue to explore and learn, we can build on the wisdom of our ancestors and create a brighter, more informed world. Section 7. Whispers of Lost Technologies. Acoustic levitation, geopolymer concrete, theories abound, each more outlandish than the last. While we haven't found concrete evidence, no pun intended, the possibility of advanced ancient knowledge is tantalizing. Perhaps the ancients knew something we don't, Perhaps they understood forces we've yet to rediscover, or maybe, just maybe, they were simply much, much smarter than we give them credit for. Section 8, Baalbek beckons, an invitation to ponder. So there you have it. Colossal stones, baffling precision, and a healthy dose of how the heck did they do that. Baalbek isn't just ruins, it's a challenge to our understanding of history. A giant question mark carved in stone. It's a reminder that we're not the be-all and end-all of civilization. That maybe, just maybe, the ancients were onto something. Something big. Something that makes our skyscrapers and bridges look like Lego projects. Section 9. Legacy in Stone. A Timeless Enigma. Baalbek, with its silent stones, whispers tales of ingenuity and forgotten knowledge. It's a reminder that our understanding of the past is constantly evolving, shaped by new discoveries and shifts in perspective. So next time you're marveling at a modern engineering feat, spare a thought for the builders of Baalbek, the ones who moved mountains literally, and ask yourself, what else don't we know? <laughs>